today on the Rainbow Loom, I will be showing you how to make a grass block for the Enderman to hold. The Enderman was in my last video. Now, the first thing for the grass block, if you want to have the secure band that sticks out like this, then um, put on a secure band. If you don't want it to stick out like that, then I'll just show you how to do that. I'll be using a, a different green for this video. So you'll be needing brown and green. Whichever green you think would suit f the grass block. A dark green or a lime green like what I'm using right now. So take two green rubber bands and put it on the two first two pegs up here. And put the, scooch them down a little bit. And then take another two brown put it from the second up to the right another two brown elastics from the middle up to the top here like that and then just take brown elastic and twist it around twice if you'd like it to be tighter you can do it another and just move that down and then twist it again twice. Now I'm going to be needing another brown elastic for the middle here so that it will stay together because we don't want it to come in two separate pieces. You can do this same design for other kinds of blocks if you want. So if you want to make a stone block then you see plain gray or other blocks sand use a, a sand kind of a color now take one brown elastic and put it from this peg over to here and make a figure eight and then loop your figure eight, eight back up to the top here so you're technically doing a, a double safety band here it squishes everything together now, you can take, you're going to be needing some C-clips when I'm finished looping here too. So if you want to get that out now, go ahead. Now, put your hook all the way under and grab only the bottom two elastics. And then bring it up to the top. So do that for the right and now for the left. Or the middle, I guess, and loop it up one. Now that you've got the two loops, it should look like a teardrop or a raindrop shape here. If it doesn't look like that, you did something wrong. Now take the bottom two green ones and hook them over here. Over one, so move it from here to here instead of going up. Now for here, if you want, if you want a secure band like what I did, take your hook and move it up through here. So you move you move it up through here and then um Yeah, there we go. And so you just put this over here and then tighten it. And so that's if you want your secure band, and then you just take it off the loom, and you're done. If you want to make it so it doesn't have a little secure band sticking out, take your C-clip, and push it down onto all of these bands. C-clip's going to be pretty crammed together, so if you want to use two C-clips, go ahead, but I don't see how you can do that, so just put them, once they're all on the C-clip, take it off, there, and now it's all together. Now just form it out for the way you want it to be. If you find it's a little loose, then you can do it over again, and for the doubles or anything, just make it tighter for the different things, but there you go. That's your grass block, and to hook it onto the Enderman, 
take another C clip and you can use those loose pieces put it on a loose rubber band that you find maybe even two just hook it on to the C clip and then take your enderman or even if you made a, a Steve hook it on to that and then hook it on to the end of his hand so there you go your enderman has a grass block if you want him to hold it with both hands you can also put on another C clip put it on like that so it'll look like this there you go grass block for your enderman